Please welcome the President of the Secretary of Transportation, Pete. Please sit down. Sit down. Good afternoon. Uh, welcome to the Council on Count, Count. And I want to begin by thanking you, President Biden, for your week. Two issues that matter so much to every American fixing supply chains and lowering the costs. As we prepare for the future in this body, it is important to reflect on this body. When President Biden first took office, the pandemic had led to 9-11, including enormous chains. We were paying more. We were waiting longer. We had about 100 ships bearing down on those West Coast ports. And some in the media, just about exactly two years ago, were saying that it was going to be canceled. We, of course, was not canceled. All through the year, President Biden all rotten, had been challenging us to stay ahead of this issue and to be prepared to respond. And so as tough as that was, we wound up having to introduce the person who has led this work, President of the United States, Joe Biden. Thank you very much, Pete. And uh, I, uh, you know, uh, I, uh, we always talk about the big gas, but sometimes the big gas don't work based on whether or not the little gas, the mechanics are in place. Secretary Buttigieg, 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 Buttigieg thank you for being here today. And thank you for being here today. And, excuse me, Council on Chain Resilience. I grew up in a family like many of you where uh, when uh, we prices went up, there was a conversation at the kitchen table. <laughs> Those conversations have been going on at kitchen tables all across America for a while now. Whether we'd have enough left over we at the end of the month for my dad to be able to used to say, have a little bit of breathing room. Well, this past week, as Americans gathered around their own kitchen tank of gas, that was our goal, <clears throat> to give them a little more breathing room. And together, we made progress. You know, uh, from Turkey to air travel to Turkey travel, tank of Turkey, costs went down. They went down. Out of people making a lot of money, it went down. A hundred container ships were waiting in the dock. That doesn't matter a whole lot because the costs are relatively small compared to this Thanksgiving dinner. Request for that. The press is particularly excited about that, I can see. But look, all kidding aside, that's not all. On Thanksgiving two years ago, major appliances like a stove or a fridge broke down, meaning that today folks start their holiday stock 9% cheaper than did two years ago. The press is particularly excited about that, I can see. These savings matter. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you.